Alright, it's episode 2 of Flatland Survival, and uh, I'm starting to think up strategies, because i got to think about limited resource space. Basically, my inventory is all that I can really keep with, with me, unless I build a little hut or settle down in a home, which I hope to do. The only concern I have with that is, uh, like, I won't be able to have as many diamonds because I won't be constantly exploring areas for new diamonds. It's not like there's renewable sources of diamond. I can't mine them either. Uh, but I could... There's iron. There's a lot of renewable resources. I already talked about that, though. Um, it's down there. Okay. Something I just got on my foot. I got it off. And this villager wants fish. Oh, I don't even think I can get fish. Yeah, I can. Water. Mm, what's going on? Now I'm thinking... One of my strategies is, is just to get... If there's a lower level tool that isn't iron, probably should just get rid of it. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Just kill these guys. Probably gonna not take any slimes from me whatsoever either. I'll take a few, cause there's like a lot of uh. Wait, did I get in this shit? Yeah, I did. Yeah, there's there's a few mob grinders that did, that require sticky pistons. I had a burp there, and uh, not sticky pistons. I think I think just pistons, but you know whatever. Okay, I got potatoes, my food, diamond. Do not need a wooden axe, definitely. Drop this. Drop this. I'm gonna get a bit more cobblestone. Okay, seeds. Don't need seeds. There's always seeds to get. Lavas. Half stone slab. Don't need those. Sticks. Fine. Okay. Crafting table. Carrots. Okay. These slimes really starting to get on my nerves. I throw my bed away. I think I may have left it where I was. Okay, let's go get another bed. Sleep out the night. We'll set sail again. Come on. So surprising none of these guys want to trade slime balls. That'd be a good trade. And here we go. The trusting craft the trusty crafting bench always prevails. It's a good thing to probably not go out at night too in Flatland, because uh Less caves means there's way less places for them to spawn on the ground. All the mobs that would regularly spawn on the ground are going to spawn above ground now. So it basically like doubles or triples the rates of spawning. Uh, it's kind of hard to see, but it was only night time for about five seconds. And we're going to continue moving on. Let's eat a bit. This all organized. Okay. Probably should have gotten some more cobblestone before I left off. Bones would be helpful too. I guess arrows will be too, if I ever want to pick up bow and arrow skills. I really only use bow and arrows if they're enchanted though, as a thing. They're kind of crappy if they're on their own. They used to be good when they were like machine guns, but no, not anymore. All that XP. Okay. Keep moving. But uh, enchanting, I think, is still possible with uh, obsidian. You need a uh, redstone. I don't. You don't need redstone. I always. I always think you need redstone because the top's red. Okay, those kind of just spawn right in front of me. Gotta dodge them. 
Okay, I got a message on Steam. I'll be right back. Okay, I think that's enough Steam messages. Alright. Let's keep going, running and gunning. Except there's no guns. And I'm not even shooting anything if I had a gun. Not even attacking. Alright. I'm just I'm just gunning, I guess. I mean running. Running and Okay. Well that's not like there's gonna be a village for a while, so I'm just gonna, you know, skip ahead. Uh never mind. There's one right there. Unless this is the one that I left and I kinda somehow reversed my travels. I could have. Where am I? I I definitely did not. I'm a thousand blocks from center. There's no way I could have been here before. Okay, I've not been here before. Blacksmith quarters. Where are you at? Let's find it. Let's find that. Anybody? Anybody? Is there really not going to be one? It's a long path. Go on to like nowhere at all. Hmm. This is not a very good village. One another thing I like about this is uh the villages are pretty big. Or at least the ones I've seen so far are pretty big. Usually the ones you've seen survival are like ten buildings max. These are all highly expansive and pretty sweet overall. So I'm just gonna keep moving. Let's try to go this direction. Let's build up our uh, Z coordinate. Oh wow, look. There it is. The village. Got Optifine zoom. I can't see I can't see a blacksmith quarters yet, so I'm not gonna get my hopes up. Maybe a uh, Christmas wish can come true. Maybe there will be one. Maybe there won't. I don't know. Uh, let's see. None that way. None this way. And none anywhere else. They're not supposed to be rare, I don't think. I mean, there's one to most villages how are these guys with trades okay I think I'm gonna harvest a bit of wheat here uh... use the bone on it if I'm, if I'm gonna be encountering this many he just broke the... whatever he just broke it, that's what he does yeah I, f I figure if I'm gonna be encountering this many villagers I better have a steady amount of emeralds going to keep my supplies up and my enchantments up too, because some of them offer enchantments. And that's good to have. Alright, what do these guys want? One emerald for bread. For arrows, 20 for that. Silk touch, that could be good. What could I use silk touch in this though? Efficiency is good too for uh, cobble farming. I'll walk around and see if there's not anything else that I can get for a few emeralds. Die, please. Looking. I, I don't even have to worry about these guys. They're harmless. Okay, back to uh, emerald farming. Let's see. What is this guy? Boots. Cookies. These guys don't really have anything that will interest me. I'll build, I have I have other time to build up emeralds, but I have to. What, where's the sun at? Okay, it's just past noon. So I think I'll push my luck and uh, move on. All right. Let's see. I'm gonna keep moving along the Z coordinate path. Try to even it out so I go on more of a diagonal path. Still walking. One other thing I like about this is the 
the frame rate is so high. Because there's nothing to render except for like five layers of ground and uh, the occasional village. That's pretty cool. Mm, slime. My back still has some pains too. It's kind of getting annoying. Uh, okay, I was about to cut away and go do something else, but here's a uh, another village. No foreseeable blacksmith. But it looks like it's a bigger village from what I can see. Oh, this is a cool little street. I don't think I've ever seen a cool, well, as organized village as this so far. No blacksmith, though. Also, I'm not sure when the last time the stairways would be put, like, right in the middle of, like, the main pathway. I mean, I, there's no cars here, but it's kind of in the way. Wow, there are no blacksmiths. This, I wish there were more interesting things too. Like maybe in the church, whatever these things are supposed to be, there could be like chests in them too, with like potions maybe. That'd be cool. It's a nice. This is a nice looking city. There is nothing wrong with this city. And uh, I'm gonna set gonna set up a little home here for the night, and uh, I'm gonna get more resources going, and I'll see you guys in just a second. All right, so I got a little little house going down here. We got our little pal downstairs. There he is. He wouldn't cooperate. He wouldn't get out of the square. So he's gonna be a little bed bunk buddy. I can only sleep at night. It's not night yet. Okay, I assumed it would be. Get the crafting bench back. I'm gonna see how long I can keep this crafting bench with me. Also, I had another idea that I, for some reason, have been missing. I could always just farm iron golems in these towns that are located here already. I haven't seen any yet. I don't think I have. Maybe I. I probably haven't. Just haven't seen. I haven't remembered them. But I think this spawn me. I have to have 16 villagers in one space in one general area. So, you know, I'm not really sure of the qualifications other than that. 99. Hey, pal. Can I get out of the door? Thank you. All right. So I'm going to look around for trades. I think that might just end the episode on this. Uh, next episode, we'll... What are my books looking like? Okay, yeah, next episode, we'll continue moving on. Look for another... Look for another blacksmith quarters. See if we can't press our luck to get more uh, diamond. I would love to have a sword of diamond. Because then I would actually have no fear in taking out any golem. Because they're easy after you have a diamond sword. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to keep moving. And I'll uh, see you guys next time.